The coffee is black. The robot is very, very frisky. And I'd like to welcome you to the Friday, September 19th edition of Modeling Blog Daily, where Bill just rants with a cup of joe. And today I'm going to cover uh, the series called Pyrites. Pyrites were manufactured several years ago in 2006. Since then, the Megablock company has come out with the Pirates of the Caribbean series. They have the franchise for the movies and uh, wonderful, wonderful sets. But back in the earlier days, they had uh, wonderful sets with the skulls. You can still find them on, on eBay and Amazon and uh, Bricklink. Uh, Bricklink doesn't sell them. But uh, why is that? Because Bricklink is uh, strictly Lego, and Bricklink, they hate pyrites and hate mega blocks. <laughs> but old Bill loves them. <laughs> he loves them. So about the only place you're going to find your used uh, mega block sets are on the eBay. But Amazon does still sell these on occasion. By the way, I have the entire series, and they have a whole whole boatload of little little skull sets. Uh, the one I did uh, earlier today was called Maroon Galley 3631, which is what you see here. Uh, uh, they have a Mutiny Owl, uh, Coffer's Trap. They're, they're really neat. I mean, they all have a unique kind of... Here they got a little octopus. Here they got a little... Uh, little shark on the, the maroon galley they got a little rowboat uh, they got the buried bounty with a little bag of gold and they're, 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 they're really neat sets the thing that I really do like about the sets in particular they they have a treasure map and the treasure map basically has all the sets laid out before you for example, Pyrite's Cove is a, a set in a metal tin that I've built on before. It's a wonderful set. Coffer's Trap is one of the little ones. Mutiny Owl is one of the little skull ones. Buried Bounty is one of the, uh, the bag of gold ones. Maroon Galley is this one. Hidden Loot is one of those bags of gold. Pieces of Eight is one of those bags of gold. Captain Cutlass's Storm... Stalker is the big ship guys. <laughs> Smuggler Ford is a big is a, is a big. They have they have all these are sets and they're on on the map and that's what makes it so cool. The other thing that the, the, these pyrite uh, skulls come with, it, not all of them, but some of them come with a a, a video of the, the series and I put it in the computer. I'm gonna just I'm not gonna play the sound. I just want to show you. Uh, they they tell the story of uh, of the pirates, and uh, if you watch this video f to conclusion, you actually will learn uh, a lot about how uh, the map works, how the how all the sets work together, and they it's a wonderfully done uh, little video, and they animate it and actually li use little uh, animations from the uh, the ships. So I would. Uh, it, it's worth it, it's worth the price of, of a mission just to get the the, the CD so you can watch the uh, watch the story and and learn how it all all pieces together. I wanted to in particular show you though these little mini things. Uh, I I realize that there's a lot of uh, my Lego fans that just don't want to have anything to do with the uh, the Mega Blocks. I love Mega Blocks. Let it be known, Bill loves Mega Blocks, all kinds, especially the pirates. I love pirates. I read books about the pirates all the time. Now you look at these little mini figs. They're all hand painted. I mean, they they might be machine painted, but I I can't imagine that it has to be hand painting. Look at the head. The head on these they rotate. They move. See how. I, and, and, and look at the little elbows. See how you can move the. Look at that. The wrist turn. See there. 
and look at the like this pirate has a a belt he has a kind of a vest and they, they don't just paint like a you know a, they have a red and then a, a, a white shirt uh, with black trim and black cuffs and even a thing it, it, they're done very well look look at this one by the way in the pyre rights the pyre rights or rates or what a pyre rates uh, series the skeletons are always the bad guys and uh, the the skeletons have the same thing there see the little knees bend so let me show you the how the see isn't that neat what that means is you can have fully po uh, you can po poise these in a marvelous way the heads turn see if you were into stop-motion photography and really wanted to do a professional job at a little movie this certainly beats out the Lego minifigs big time I mean big time guys I know you Lego guys don't want to hear it but you could do so much you could be so creative with these little minifigs from from Mega Blocks. Uh oh, uh oh. <coughs> plop. Plop, plop, fizz, fizz. Oh, what a relief it is. <laughs> That's Alka Seltzer, by the way. Here's a, a sword. Now, they don't just do swords, they got like see through blue and then solid. See, it's, it's, so you got see through parts and then solid parts they mix the plastics they're very creative in the way they do their moldings and here's a a skeleton with his wrist look at that the wrist is painted silver look at the details of his rib cage he's got a little skeleton on his belt aren't they aren't they absolutely stunning I, I know I've, I've said this before. I've never shown you the detail. And look at the head. You can move it. See? So you, if you were doing a stop motion video, man, you could be, you, you could do so many things. And this set is like five bucks, guys. See, you see the, uh, no, you don't get the light. The light doesn't, <laughs> doesn't come with it. But see, the, the back, the base just clips up in there so you can throw all the parts in there. And what a wonderful set for, uh, for little money, anyhow, and you get the the little movie and the, and the, it's done up so well, well worth it, well worth it, guys. Bill and Red, wishing for you and yours a wonderful day ahead, or an evening ahead, or a weekend ahead. <laughs> and my and my robot snores. Sayonara, friend. Sayonara. Arg, arg. <laughs> we'll see you guys.